time. Defeated by a human. Who's that? <laughs> the future lord of this planet. Celebrate your brief victory. Why didn't you fire? At that guy? That was just a hologram! Father, calm down. He's an outlander and doesn't know much about Kamut. Quiet! Bro, chill! Let me introduce myself. I'm Major Marco Rossi of the regular army. How may I help you? No need. Father, shall we go? You go back. And you? Father, you were gone for so long. Don't you miss home? I don't have a home. Until the day I find the four gems and eliminate that devil, there is no home for me. Father! Father! Ah, uh, don't be sad, kiddo. All fathers and daughters fight. Oh, I'm used to it. <laughs> He's a- Your father... He has a feud with that hologram? Hologram? You mean the Pharaoh? He's the sworn enemy of the entire Bastet clan. No, make that everyone in Kamut. The Pharaoh? Sounds old. He was the very last Pharaoh of the ancient empire, approximately 4,000 years ago. 4,000 years? 
He looks quite a character, but I didn't expect him to be that old. Oh, absolutely. Legends say he unlocked some forbidden power and gained immortality. Even the most powerful Bastet, the goddess of war, could only hold him temporarily in the pyramid. Huh. Is that why your father's on the hunt for the four, uh... The four gems. They were created at the very beginning of the world, and they bear a power that can cleanse all evil. Holy cow! That's a lot older! He's basically looking for a needle in a haystack! That's not entirely true. An ancient home has been passed down concerning the whereabouts of the four gems. As the glory of the world's beginning dissipated, slowly but surely, the dark force awakened. The lava gem inflamed the very earth. The purification gem became blacker than black. The Volt Gem manifested the commandments of the desert. The Gravity Gem belonged to the Last Guardian. Well, that doesn't help much. Your old man is a stubborn one. How can he possibly solve this riddle? is the prophetic poem left by Lord Bastet. It has been a guiding light for the Kamut people in their times of darkness. I wish my father could lead an easier life, but I believe in Lord Bastet with my whole heart. Interesting. I respect your faith. Get home safely. I've got work to do. Hope to see you again.
time. told you to dig for bazookas? Here? Yeah. He said the bazookas were buried in hot soil. Hard to believe there's such a huge lava pool under Kamut. But this makes total sense. <laughs> well, that sounds chancy, but bazookas are very tempting. I wish I could try them all. Simple. You bring me along, and I'll bring all the bazookas. You. Come on. I won't slow you down. I, don't get me wrong. I'm flattered. You are my best intel chief. Okay. Theo, welcome to the team. Yeah. <laughs> I'm fine. All good. sure you're not stalking me? <laughs> Check this out! Braised bread crab. Oh, I'm a bit overcooked. Ah! This lava crab is a rare variant that lives in the lava pool. A crab surviving in the hot lava is against science. How is that even possible? Many things in Kamut are beyond your common sense. If you want to learn the secrets, you must accept the mysteries. Wow, that's deep. So what exactly are you trying to say? Well, lava is known as the Earth Fire in Kamut. The first line of the prophecy might be a reference to this place. Since you're already here, would you like to help me search? Uh, do I have a choice? I can't leave a little girl in this place all by herself. 